Hey guys, Dan Heilman here. We are back with another Awaken Chaos Era video. Today I'm on the free to play account. I want to show you my Queen 11 team. Uh, this is the team I use to farm Queen 11. It is uh, not fast, it is not fast at all, but it's fairly easy to build. So I will show you the auto run here. Um, it's playing right now. I, it is 100%. I have not lost one yet. So that's great. I need to push the stats a little bit higher so I can get up into 12, but uh, I actually haven't even really tried 12 with this team yet. But uh, yeah, we're farming away. I'll show you the auto run first. And then after that, I will go through all of their gear and show you their stats and all of that good stuff. So, okay, enjoy the auto run and I'll be back in a little bit to go over their gear. All right, now we're at the boss. I'll show you what happens here. I focus the right ad first because the right ad heals, so you got to get the right ad down first. Uh, in the beginning, my Santis was constantly dying. So, you know, she's the same affinity as the boss, so she gets targeted before any of my, you know, my Rogi or my Rodira do. Uh, and my Hakron's pretty tanky, so he's got a lot of defense, so I don't mind too much if he gets targeted. But uh, I had to get Santis up to level 60, and I had to level up a lot of her gear. She does take the prism. I think what I need to do going forward is I need to get more attack on little Rogi over there, my turtle. Um, because when he is stunned in the prison, he can still do damage, but uh, Santis cannot. So I think that's my next thing is I'm going to try to get uh, pump some attack on Rogi there. I need to get some better gear for him. Uh, his gear is just okay, but I'll go through all their gear in a minute here. Uh, this is It's going to take a while. It <laughs> might be a decently long video, but it's not going to be too bad. Look at that retaliation strike for 2866. Not bad at all. Is it all you do? Poison spread from Santos. You can see 2866 every time. Poison's only doing 1500 damage, so that's uh, like two poison techs every time uh, Rogi gets hit. All right, right ads down. Now we're going to focus on the boss. Another prism on Santos. Is it all you do? just chipping away it takes forever but it's 100 percent and it works i can just start the run i can walk away go do whatever i want to do come back hour later <laughs> and i got some loot i can finally get six star gear which is used on the free-to-play account this is the first one i can farm uh stage 11 consistently so it's really big for me Rodir just cleansed the prison off, so that's pretty cool. Rodir is a great unit, especially here in Queen. My Hakron is only ascended one time too, so I don't even have his increased trait. Once that happens, I think I'll be able to get into 12. 
um, pump up their gear a little bit, and I think I'll be good to do 12. It's going to be slow, but I mean, if it works, it works. See the cursed proc there in Santis. My Santis is in a cursed set. In the beginning, she was in the worst cursed set ever, but I actually have a decent one for her now. All right, we're chugging along, eight percent. I love the AOE heal and decrease up from Rodira. So strong. All right, we got another uh, prison there, and the boss is dead. All right, I can't show you the damage summary because I'm in multi battle, but. Uh, yeah, alright, let's hit finish here. Let's look really quick what I got. Ooh. Defense. I don't have a lot of good gear on the free-to-play, so I save a lot more than normal. I'm not going to save that one. Okay, now let's go through the team. I'll show you what everyone's in. Uh, the most crucial one here is definitely going to be Santis and Rogi. They uh, need to be built pretty decent. So, let's go through them. Alright, let's go through Santis first. So... Glyphs are pretty much max. I don't have this one. It just gives me attack and resistance, which isn't that useful. Her abilities are maxed. She is in a Cursed set, and she does have some level 15 gear. So I'll show you what she's got going on here. I'll just go through the gear very quickly. Defense, health, focus, really good item. Uh, this is just for the HP. So health, a little bit of defense, and a little bit of flat defense. Uh, health, focus, defense. You can see what I'm doing. Health, focus, and defense. Health, uh, a little bit of agility. I, those have some room for improvement. Defense, health, focus. And health, defense, and focus. Okay? So basically the same on everything. All the gear pieces. 17,000 HP. 1,500 defense. Uh, no speed, which is still good. It's what you need. 64% focus. Tiny bit of agility. Again, I, I want to uh, get... God, excuse me. All right, so that's Santa. She's only ascended twice, so I need to get three more ascensions for her. That's crucial. That will be uh, huge. Okay, so Rogi, he's the other important guy here. I'll show you his gear. He's got a revival set on with a life set. I'll show you what we got going on. Health percent is the most we need. That stat we're trying to focus on here. Health percent again. Health percent, a little bit of defense, a little bit of crit rate doesn't help for him, and focus to land taunt is okay, but not needed. Health percent with some speed and health and agility. Health percent with defense percent and flat health. I want as much health as possible, so honestly, health percent and flat health is not bad together. Health percent, uh, flat health, some speed, some defense. Glyphs are kind of maxed. Um, I can get some more defense if I want to. His abilities are maxed. And uh, let's show you his stats. So he's got almost 20,000 HP, which is awesome. I need a little bit more attack so he can take the prison. And then uh, defense is 1,500, which is solid. Speed is low. Um, doesn't matter too much. He gets that counterattack damage, so that's kind of the point. Uh, and that's it. Tiny bit of crit rate, tiny bit of crit damage. Okay, let's go look at... Next person is Hakrin. Hakrin, honestly, he really needs the second ascension. Once I get this, I think I'll be able to move up to 12 with a little bit extra gear. Um, but yeah, so let's show you the gear. Defense percent is all I care about and health percent, okay? He is in defense sets. He's got two defense sets and one broken set. You can see health and defense. Focus, agility, defense, all good stats for him. Defense percent, health percent, focus percent, I mean focus, speed. Defense percent, health percent, defense, and defense, health percent, and a little bit of resistance. So that's his gear. Um, glyphs are pretty much maxed. Abilities are maxed. Stats are 1,400, 14,000 health, 2,500 defense, which is pretty low. My uh, hacker on my main account has over 4,000 defense. <laughs> so he's still level 50, but we got some room for improvement. A little bit of focus, a little bit of resistance, and uh, basically no speed. Okay, and then let's go over Radira. Her, I want to focus HP because um, her AoE deals uh, heals based on her health. So I got this one with three rolls into health percent, um, a little bit of speed on it. 
This one has three rolls into health percent again. This one has two rolls into health percent. Uh, this is health with some speed and defense. This one is health with defense and resistance. And this one is health with defense percent. So those are the, that's the gear. Glyphs are pretty much maxed. Um, abilities are maxed. I'll show you the stats here. 15,000 HP for level 50, not bad. Um, 1,100 defense. Uh, speed, I want her to go first so she can buff the increased defense. And then, um, yeah, that's that. Okay, that's all the stats. That's all the gear. That's all the units. That's it for the video, really. I just wanted to show you guys. Uh, oh, I got my foodie quest done here for obtain six star gear. That's cool. Just gives me gold. Wow. Anyways, that's the 11 team. It's 100%. It's slow. Um, I guess I can show you. Yeah, here up on the screen. It takes about 80 some minutes to complete a 10 run, but it is 100%. So that's all I need to get my gear. I'm starting to get that six dark gear. I get some cursed gear. I get some revival gear and I get some attack gear. It's awesome. I love queen. Love those three gear sets. So, okay. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. I just want to show you my free to play account, what I'm doing to farm queen 11. The team is pretty easy to build. Doesn't require a crazy amount of resources and it's 100%. It is slow as hell, but you know, it is what it is. So, okay. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did get on there smash the like button sub to the channel if you're not already and have a great day everyone hope you guys enjoyed the video uh it's monday so have a good week everyone see you guys